Living every day, laughing every moment, and loving beyond words with family and friends, that's what life's all about. About that, that I'm too bad. The boys got saved and they got a new swag. You didn't know about me. I'm on I love to cook, I love to entertain, and I love living my life as I know it. I'm on the new life, sipping that spirit there to get you so right. He ain't on Maybe you me. didn't know that I rock Christ in my life when I spit the flow. That I rock nice on the mic with the lyrical. Boy, I rock right so they might get it the spirit. YouTube family, we're back with another Cooking with Soul video, and today we are doing barbecue oxtails. Let's go. The ingredients will be in the information box, but as you see now, we are combining our pepper and onion mix and combining that with the washed oxtails that I have here. And as you see, I'm trying to struggle and get it out of the bowl, so I'm going to mix it and combine it and use my hand. And as I told y'all before, hand is using for loving, and so that. That's why I call this cooking with soul because you're cooking from the soul. You're cooking, putting love in it. So as you're doing this, mixing up your meat with your onions and peppers, um, we're going to go ahead and prepare another ingredient, and that is drizzling this with some oil. So now I'm taking my olive oil, my olive oil, vegetable oil, you can use whatever. I think it's like two or three tablespoons. Pour it all, and that's all what I had in there. So I'm just using that. And then what you're gonna do now is combine it and mix it together and get it all good and coated with your oil and whatnot. And so, um, y'all, this is gonna look really, really good. And once I add the seasoning, ah, this stuff is gonna look good. And so um, now I'm combining the again, I'm combining the oil and the peppers and onions along with my oxtails which I got at a good price but I found out on Instagram it's not as good as the other prices so hey this was really good but it was really tasty now what I'm going to do is add in some barbecue seasoning if you don't have no barbecue seasoning make your own do just like I did I made my own barbecue rub and so what I'm putting putting it on here before I mix it together um, is going to um, make at least about oh I want to say I don't know don't get me the line everything is going to be below in the information box so as you can see I'm combining it with the peppers and onions the barbecue uh when well that barbecue with the oxtails and um, the oil and y'all it just really looks like barbecue so that's why they call it the barbecue rub once it mix and once you get it wet it looks like barbecue and so speaking of barbecue that's part of one of my ingredients that I'm going to show y'all and it is from the grill masters club so shout out to the grill masters club for sending me some products and I'm going to show you that product in just a minute what we're doing is putting it everything combining it in a large pot I was disobedient and put it in the medium. We're going to brown it around, brown everything. Not cook it all the way, but brown it. And that's what I did. Brown it in this large pot, and then we're going to transfer everything over to the crock pot. But listen to this sizzling. Just listen. You see that? You hear it? Sounds like good, right? All right, here we go. We're going to um, transfer everything into the crock pot. And then um, after that, we're going to prepare our sauce to go in here to prepare the liquids. And so we're not going to wash this pot out. So don't say, ooh, look at that pot. No, don't do that. We're going to add three cartons of this, um, either vegetable stock, um, beef stock, chicken stock, or water, whatever you're using. What I'm using is beef stock. And so I think it's like three cups, three or four cups. That's what we're doing. And so here is the barbecue sauce. And again, shout out to um, Grill Masters Club for sending me some products. And y'all gonna see some more of the products that Grill Master Club sent. But this sent. But this is my first um, tutorial for this video. Add it into the pot with everything, the pot liquor and everything that was left into the 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 pot that I used to brown the medium. And then we're gonna stir that up and transfer it over to uh, the crock pot. Cook it on six uh, hours low. Y'all, after that, it's going to look just like this. Put the lid on it. Now bring it back up. And it's going to be so good, y'all. This meal was good. I love oxtails, whether it's roasted, whatever. 
cook um, on in a pot, cook on a pan, whatever, however you cook it. I love me some oxtails, and this is barbecue oxtails. It is just done just right, right after six hours, cooking it on low. And during that day today um, that I cooked this, um, I had a big, I had a big um, community meeting that I had to go to. And so after when I got home, my food was done. And here is the pictures that I've taken of the food, and it was done. And what I served with it, I served this on top of a bed of rice, and then I had some white beans and some green beans. As you can see, y'all, this was good. Again, shout out to um, Real Masters Club for their recipe. Uh, not recipe, not recipe, but the barbecue sauce that I used. And um, information is going to be below. Thank you all so much for watching. Know that I love you for real. And always remember to live every day, laugh every moment, and love beyond words. I'll see you all on the next video here on Life As I Know It. For you desire, I promise I'll give you my life. With no intention of separating, no hesitation, Lord, you know I cling to your clothes.